I am going to be seeing Kim Hyoyeon, my ultimate bias in Singapore. <laughs> I got I got this DM. He said, Congratulations, we are happy to inform you that you are one of the meet and greet winners to meet DJ Hyo in person tomorrow. Please reply with your full name, mobile number. Similar details would be needed for your friend who is tagging along. I was shaking. I knew I had to film a reaction to it, which is this one right now. I know I had to film one. But how do you even... Basically what I said was, I deserve to win that chance because I will be flying in from the Philippines to Singapore. And honestly, it's, you know, it's the truth. I will be flying to Singapore for my bias, which is expensive. Basically, you have, all you have to do is tag a friend and comment down below why you deserve to win that chance to meet her. Speaking of the friend that I'll be tagging along, I contacted two of my closest friends, Shan and Let's. Uh, I waited, but Let's confirmed and she told me that she'll actually be going. She booked the ticket immediately and now we're going to see Hyoyeon. We're going to see Hyoyeon. <sighs> we're going to see Hyoyeon, guys. We're going to see Hyoyeon. Like, not just see Hyoyeon, but like, meet her. Honestly, I don't even know what we're gonna do.
spells my name? Did you know that Yuri spelled my name wrong? She wrote that letter T. Yes. Please go to the Philippines. Okay. Mahal ko kayo. Mahal ko kayo. Mahal ko kayo. Mahal ko kayo. So I just want to. Oh, oh, hi, Shoyan. I, I didn't see you there. <laughs> so I just want to tell you how everything went. At like 2 a.m., we were instructed to go out of the venue to meet the organizer. And then she'd be escorting us to the DJ lounge. Then we were asked to leave Future because the meet and greet would be held at the DJ lounge at Zook. You know, when we were outside, I thought of, you know, preparing stuff to show to Hyoyeon, how to guide Hyoyeon to properly write what I'm going to say. So what I did was I wrote down my name on my arm. Basically, it says Hyo Heart Rich. I wrote that on my arm. And I don't know what the others did, but what happened next was that we were already being called in. That's when I realized everything. I was in front of her. I was literally meeting her while she was like adjusting her ponytail she was there she was just me going near her i was shaking the whole time i gave her my book i told her my name was rich i said here love rich and she was like oh rich she said my name and then she started signing my book she signed my book which basically said to Hyo Love Rich and yeah, signature and question mark thingy that she put in. And also, by the way, while she was like signing my book, I took a video with my hand literally shaking and then she looked at it and she smiled. She smiled and I knew I, I haven't like realized that moment yet that I was finally in one photo with her. After you know, she like signed my, I asked her to shake her hand and she was like, we both shook our hands. You know, let's got her turn. We all told her that we are both from the Philippines and we told her to visit the Philippines, which I don't know, but Let's and I both claim that Hyo's long vacation in Boracay was somehow influenced by us. So we were literally telling her, please come to the Philippines. We are from the Philippines. And she was just like, okay. I don't know, but maybe some a part of that made her want to search about the Philippines and you know take a long vacation here and then you know it was a time to take pictures um let's and i took turns i was supposed to give my phone to let's so that she'll take pictures of me but the staff were really super nice they were the ones who took my phone were the ones who took pictures of us and there was also like this official photographer who took pictures of us what happened after was you know let's recording hyoyan saying mahal ko kayo and um see you in the philippines and all that stuff and after that, you know, we just left and we processed everything. Let's and I went out of the club. We didn't even notice that there was like stretchers everywhere and like drunk people passing out just beside us. We didn't, we, we did not notice those things. You know, it was just a wonderful experience overall that until now I could still feel how it felt like how magical it was how fulfilling it was for someone like me to have finally you know to, have, to finally meet Kim Hyoyeon the person that I've been idolizing the person that I've been listening to the person that I've been following ever since Jeannie the person that I've been supporting the person that's inspired me that no matter how underrated you are if you just keep working hard and you let your talent shine you are going to shine I finally met her
I finally met Kim Hyoyeon. I met her, I got to shake her hand. We have photos together, we have selfies together. You know, I guess I'll have to accept the fact that I was just really lucky to have finally met the love of my life. Like, I'm not being dramatic. She is the love of my life. <laughs> so yeah. So yeah, I hope you all enjoy the rest of this vlog. I'm <laughs> sorry.